Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Now we'll look at some of the basic concepts of printing. When you print from Photoshop, you can send the image to a printing device to be transferred onto paper, film, a printing plate, or sent directly to a digital printing press. When you print a complex graphic, in order to create the illusion of continuous tones when printed, images are broken down into a series of dots. This process is called halftoning. When you change the sizes of the dots in a halftone screen, it creates the illusion of variations of gray or continuous color in the image. When you are having it printed in a commercial printing situation, each color in the image must be printed on separate master plates. This is the process of color separation and typically uses CMYK inks. You can adjust how the plates are created and also make traps for color in Photoshop. To print one copy of the current image to your default printer with the default settings, select File and then print one copy from the menu bar. To set printing options, however, select File and then Print instead, and that will launch the Print dialog box where you can select a printer and set the print options that we'll look at in the next lesson. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.